Bixby wanted to get voters' reactions to Tuesday night's election results and spoke with locals who are Donald Trump, Hillary Clinton or Bernie Sanders supporters. Some say the general election in November will be the hardest yet in terms of decision-making. We talked to both Republicans and Democrats at Cal Poly, at Trader Joe's in San Luis Obispo and at Pismo Beach. Being my first time being able to vote, it's kind of difficult. Now I have to pick between Clinton and Trump, two not very respectable nominees, says Cal Poly student Hokulani Gunderson. No matter if you are Republican or Democratic, you have to vote for the right person. It doesn't matter, you have to see what their beliefs are and what their values are, says Mitra Nafisi, academic counselor at Cal Poly. Either way, history is going to be made. I think a lot of people need to be part of that and they are hoping it might sway one way or another. It's a hard year for me, personally, because I don't know quite where I stand with the candidates says Jenica Frisk. We all need to not look at the Democrats or Republicans and look at our country, says Maggie Seidel, staff member at Cal Poly. I am for Donald Trump because he is for Second Amendment rights and I think he will straighten this country, says Mike Russell. When you look at what they are saying and what really the country needs, I don't see it in any of the candidates, says Stephen Lawrence. You could see it coming but I was hoping California would vote for Bernie. It seemed like it is going to be a tough race, but it is just not the way it turned out, says Cal Poly student Justin Chur. I am disappointed. I am a lifelong Democrat and I will ultimately support whoever the candidate is, says Sarah Almira, Cal Poly student. The general election is scheduled for Tuesday, November 8th.